Hi what's up everyone in this video we will talk about the best cheap gaming headset you can buy on Amazon. Please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for more videos. This list is based on my personal opinion and research and lists them based on quality features and pricing. If you want more information and updated pricing on the products mentioned be sure to check the links in the description below. Are you looking for a low-cost gaming headset? Be cautious, the quality of inexpensive gaming headphones varies greatly. These are the best cheap gaming headsets for PlayStation, Xbox, and Nintendo Switch, with over 25 common models reviewed. In our selection, there are over 200 plus scores. However, with the release of the PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series 10, as well as the need to stay at home due to a virus, I decided to investigate the best cheap gaming headset for the PlayStation 5, PlayStation 4, Xbox Series 10, Xbox One, Nintendo Switch, and tablets. I have prepared this video guide for the best cheap gaming headset so let's get started. 5 colon Nubwo N7 it's nice to have a soft, light headband, but not if it can't properly support the large ear cushions. The large ear pads on the N7 are simply too big to wear comfortably, the cushions almost sink over your ears. Although the microphone output is a little flat and rises in volume when there is sound around you, you are audible. The sound in games is too flat, it lacks vibrancy and bass. Immersive gaming audio is a form of audio that is used to immerse the player in for your games, music, movies, and more. Dual 50mm speaker drivers are designed to create a detailed, balanced soundscape with ultra low distortion. Noise cancelling mic The omnidirectional microphone captures the user's voice while filtering out distracting background noise. 4 colon MPOW EG3 Pro. In addition to the EG10, MPOW also offers the EG3 Pro, a fantastic budget gaming headset. The EG3 Pro is a larger, more durable model with metallic parts that sound and look solid and keep the ear cups and band together. The thick big cushions will fall easily around the ears for most people. It might be too big for smaller heads. The microphone makes your voice sound loud and complete once again but it lacks some of the treble that your voice has on the EG10. When it comes to game sounds, the EG3 Pro gives the mid-tones more attention, so it's easier to position action on your left and right, although this emphasis can make the sound a bit harsh at times, a problem all headsets with boosted mids have. It's still a wonderful performer for the money. 3 colon Onikuma K9 A headset with a typical film-like approach to sound, dark and bassy, with quite a bit of space in the sound, so environments in Destiny 2, for instance, sound different from each other. The mids are a bit too recessed to precisely place the action around you, unfortunately. Although the cushions brush the outsides of your ears, the headband has a dense padding that is comfortable. The microphone, on the other hand, is useless, the voice is harsh and tinny, and background noise is amplified far too loudly. 2 colon MPOW EG10 Will you prefer to shop for less than $25? The EG3 Pro, and the EG10 from MPOW are two excellent options for the money. Both are excellent options, but the EG10 is a smaller model that might be better suited to smaller heads. Why is the EG10 so effective? It's the cheapest headset in the survey, but it has one of the best microphones. It reproduces your voice in a perfect, absolute, and transparent manner, almost studio like. It's also comfortable to wear on your head, but the cushions could use a little more padding. In the sound department, the EG10 provides a full, warm sound, with plenty of detail in the mid tones. It has a decent sound stage as well meaning the sound feels everywhere around you, although it can be tricky to place where the action comes from precisely. 1 colon Razer Kraken X While Razer's gaming devices have a large following, the Kraken X headset does not. One of the worst models tested is the microphone. 
your voice will sound harsh and weak, and there will be crackles on the line. The headband is comfortable, yet the round cushions press on your ears a bit, which is annoying if you're wearing glasses. Sound-wise, there's a lot of emphasis on mids, which are often controlled but can sometimes be a bit harsh during explosions and other loud sound effects. Unfortunately, there's too little space in the sound to properly position action around you. So guys this was the video about the best cheap gaming headset. All the links are given in the description, do check them out. If you enjoyed the video be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more videos. Thank you.